girl, love is crazy, girl, love is crazy You are messy, girl, you are messy But I cause I'm only really want to play me Omo, oh, this is so sad. Moyo Lawao is in premium tears as her private videos are circulating online. Frankly speaking, a lot is really going on in the Nigerian entertainment industry. Releasing the bedroom videos of the females in the industry seems to be the latest trend now. Yes, I use the word releasing and not leaking the videos for a reason which you would find out before the end of this video. Meanwhile, you are highly welcome to my YouTube channel guys. If you're new here, you are very welcomed. Please, I beg you, kindly subscribe and don't forget to turn on the notification bell for latest G's and trending news as we continue to serve you with the latest, all right? Like I said earlier, releasing the bedroom videos of female celebrities seems to be the latest trend in Nigeria. First, it was the popular Nigerian hip-hop Afrobeat singer Tiwa Savage, then the beautiful Nollywood actress Empress Njama, whose video was released by her ex, then the popular TikTok lady Buba Girl, whose video was also released by her ex, and now Nollywood actress Muyo Lawal. This is terrible, honestly. There must be more to these videos releasing a leaking than we know, but we will find out before the end of this video. Since the bedroom video of Nollywood actress Muyo Lawal leaked online, a lot of people have different opinions and views regarding the clip. Why majority of people, especially Nigerians, believe it was an intentional, pre-recorded and deliberately released video video especially for the fact that Moyo kept looking at the camera and asking the guy man to look as well and also she didn't totally undress herself in the video and not just that some people believe she intentionally hid that bakus from the camera and even the man's pimping wasn't showing as well which made a lot of people believe she deliberately released the video a lot of people i mean almost all the comments i have seen regarding this so far are all saying the video was intentionally released by Moyo Lawa and not actually leaked as she claimed. Why so many others, especially men, are even saying the video was too boring for their liking that the guy man who appeared in the video know to sabi work as in he didn't know how to make proper use of Moyo's endowment. Even my fellow gender believed she intentionally released the video for clout. But the big question so many people have failed to ask is to what end? Why would she intentionally release her own videos or why would she not intentionally release her own videos could she have done that ignoring the fact that she is a woman and in africa especially in nigeria when this type of thing happens the women are the ones bearing the blood we will eventually get to that but before i say anything just calm down and watch this video guys and please kindly subscribe to my youtube channel as you do so all right guys um i just want to talk about this i saw a, a video that is trending on twitter instagram facebook which happens to be a sex tape of my colleague Moyo Lawa. and reading through the comment section i see that a lot of people are alleging that these ladies they leak these sex tapes themselves for clout my question is why would someone leak their own sex tape for clout? Is it to become more popular? Is it to be talked about? Will brands reach out to you if you leak your own sex tape online and say, hey, we saw your sex tape and we want you to be our brand ambassador. Leaking your own sex tape online Will they add some sort of funds to your account? Is there any honor in having your sex tape or your nude pictures all over the social media platforms? I may be ignorant. I just want someone to educate me. In my opinion, I don't think that they leak their sex tapes for clout. Especially not in this, not in this, not this period. You can see that for some reason, I think this is the most sensible reaction I have seen concerning this video so far. If we say she did this to trend, to what end? 
would any brand actually hire her what would she do with the trend like what would she do with the popularity like this nollywood actor said someone should please educate me i know so many of us may think this is him trying to defend a colleague and funny enough i am also thinking that that is exactly the case here in as much as i am feeling pity for moyo i think to some extent she intentionally released this video you think someone who openly said the last thing you can use to drag her down is her sex video would give a hoot if her private videos are released online before you judge me for saying this just watch these videos guys one nipple one pair of nipple will be shown to nigeria which nipple will it be the beautiful delectable sexy moyo's nipple so about this matter right i wanted to keep quiet you know because i'm not a fighter neither do i know how to insult however i've made way too many sacrifices like i said no to too many things in my life like even people who have dated me, people who have tried to date me on this app, they know how I am when it comes to sex matters. So the last thing you can try to use to drag me down is sex. Nah, 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 nah. Nah. You will not now you can see that so many people who are saying she intentionally released this video are not entirely wrong you can see how free she is about her sex life first i think she may have released this for video for clout and this is my reason she is an actress the popularity she will get from this will make producers want to feature her because now she has more audience this is an entertainment industry we are talking about not some church or school scenario where high moral standards are the big deal if she had been a pastor or just a brand influencer i would have said oh okay this is a dent on her image because no brand would want to work with her because of the stigmatization but guys she is an actress she is fully into the entertainment industry and let's stop acting like we don't know what our entertainment industry looks like presently she is already enjoying the proceeds even her tiktok account and social media pages are now so active they are currently on fire which is one of the objectives and moreover i don't think waiting on brand to hire her which could be could have been her primary goal here i have seen some comments on twitter on facebook and all of them are claiming they don't know her before now until they watch the video which means she's getting the popularity she seeks and for those asking what she would do with this popularity go ask tiwa savage what she did with hers tiwa's own was leaked but she's still working with her head high in fact she has even gained more followers since then so conclusively i think presently i don't know about the old ones so but presently most of our nigerian celebrities are now intentionally releasing their videos for some personal gains and i think it is high time the nigerian police force started digging into these cases honestly to reduce the rate at which this whole thing is trending well these are my honest opinion i know this may come off as blaming the victim you know in nigeria we like to play the pity card nobody wants to hear the honest truth but in this case i do not entirely believe she is the victim but like i said though this is just my opinion Sha. on the other hand it may be that she is being blackmailed i only said the things i said judging from her past videos which are still on her tiktok accounts all right guys if you have watched up to this point thank you so much please do well to let me know what you think about this whole shenanigan in the comment section below and please i beg you kindly subscribe to my youtube channel as you do so stay beautiful and have a nice day thank you